This is Vicki Condi Systems Technical Support and here today to show you how to configure your driver for the 9700 Epson. This is uh, uh, one of the new printers that we're going to sell here at Condi and also the 7700 which um, uh, was is some of the bigger uh, wider format printers. So the demonstration I'm going to give you today on configuring the driver would also apply to the 7700. I have a 9700 that we're going to demonstrate with, but the settings would be the same. Different driver for the 7700, but the same settings. So um, the thing you need to distinguish is 3264 bit when you install a driver. Make sure that you're using a 30. I'm sorry that you have uh, that you know whether you have a 3264 bit uh, system, and then install your driver and then configure the settings the same way as I will demonstrate here in this video with the 9700. Um, I'm going to right click with my driver already installed and as you would have to install your driver at this point and also have the ICC profiles uh, for this uh, system which is created here at Condi. If you don't have the profiles contact your support uh, members at Condi Systems. So um, right click go to properties and if you're in Windows 7, you're going to go to Wind I'm sorry, Printer Properties in Windows 7, Printer Properties, XP, Vista People Properties. And uh, we go to Properties first because we need to install the ICC profiles under Color Management. My profiles um, are likely already here, but I am going to show you uh, how to get them if they're not um, already in your in your list box. So first off, I need to choose the uh, Epson uh, 9700 um, and that's going to be to find it in here this is Epson Stylus Pro 9700 and with the 9700 and the 7700 you get two profiles I'll quickly exp explain the difference and detail it out more for you as we go into the install um, you get a speed a profile for speed and one for quality and those will be in your driver settings and when I get to those settings um, I will refer back to um, the profiles here in this box so that you'll uh, be able to relate to what I'm talking about so there's two different profiles which which will apply with the settings under your uh, quality options on the driver and I'll show you that in just a minute so if you don't have these profiles make sure you get them and uh, install them um, with the install instruction that we also have on our web page on how to install profiles. I'm going to click add and then uh, that's going to bring up your profile folder and we would be able to scroll down and find your 7700 ICC profiles that you would have gotten here from your uh, tech support uh, here at Condi. So with mine already selected I don't have to find them in the list but this is how you would get them and uh, make sure they're they're in this box. So uh, once that's done you just click close. We're going to go to the advanced and we're going to click on the start printing after last page is spooled. This basically um, helps with quality issues it basically sends the data to the printer and allows the printer to receive the data before it starts printing uh, by default your driver settings will be here which means that it prints as data is being sent to the printer and uh, for quality purposes we want the data to be sent and then print so um, the printer is not trying to keep up so it will reduce the banding make sure you choose start printing after last page is spooled once that's selected click on your general tab and then click on left click on your preferences that opens up a new dialog box where we're going to change some settings um, your media type for the 7700 and the 9700 is going to be media type enhanced matte paper you don't see that in the list you're going to drop down to matte paper and you're going to move your mouse over and uh, find enhanced matte paper and check that or left click on it and that should be added into the field color this by default will you won't have to change this is what it should be quality options um, 
print quality drop down this is where your ICC profiles we'll talk more about those uh, you're going to left click on quality options and this is where you're going to see um, your speed and there is a profile for your 7700 and 9700 that is created for speed and it'll say speed um, in the profile and then the other one which says quality uh, would be a quality setting of four so based on which one you select or, or choose to use would be where this level is um, I recommend starting off with the speed and I'm going to leave mine on two because we want um, to be able to run the printer probably faster and I wouldn't use this higher quality option unless you needed it or you were advised by someone here at support but it is there if you need it and um, it's um, it's a different profile for um, for if you want your printer to use more quality than speed and it would slow your printer down so I recommend using setting 2 and the profile that says speed in it and once that's selected um, that you'll see your print quality here of fine 720 by 720 dpi you're going to check all these boxes high speed edge smoothing finest detail and then you'll click ok um, then you'll come down to your mode make sure you select custom mode and then drop down and find your ICM so you'll left click on ICM now once you click on the custom radio button this advanced uh, selection will light up you'll be able to click that and in here what you want to see is the ICM mode in the drop down you're going to choose the driver ICM advanced and then you're going to check all of um, these three boxes here so show all profiles image and graphics okay and these are the things you want in the field input profile is going to be the sRGB intent is perceptual and now your printer profile where we talked about the E7700 uh, Ditrans RGB sublimation ENHM speed and uh, you're going to use that profile here um, the one we installed and talked about under the quality options this is the profile you're going to put there okay and once that's selected you're going to come down to your graphics box your Adobe RGB 1998 is your input profile your intent is relative here your printer profile again is the 7700 Ditrans RGB uh, speed ICC profile which you will receive with your um, ink purchases here at Condi for this printer and so you're going to click OK and now we're going to go to page layout and with the Epson's we can mirror the image under the page layout for sublimation purposes you would mirror the images most of the products would require you to mirror it so you can mirror it here on the driver and uh, some of you may choose to mirror it in the application but uh, you do have the option to mirror it here on the driver and then you're going to go back to your main tab where you'll save your setting and here you're going to type in the Condi photo and you're going to click save and it's going to ask me uh, if I want to overwrite the setting I'm just going to say OK but it may not ask you that and that's fine but uh, I had already had one created so it asked me that so again this is how you set up your driver configurations for the Epson Stylus Pro 9700 are the 7700 uh, printers that you purchase here at Condi or for sublimation again if you have any questions or concerns if anything you'd like to ask about the setup or you need help with it feel free to call us here at Condi um, and our number is 1-800-826-6332 my name is Vicki and I thank you for your time